Hello, this is Reverend Atkins, uh, your mayor from Borough of Roselle. Just wanted to come to you and talk to you about something that's uh, about to occur in our community tomorrow. Um, so we've been told that this is the calm before all of our attention is going to go towards a tropical storm that's headed our way. Um, I'm being told that the wind gust is going to be somewhere in the neighborhood of about 50 to about 60 miles per hour. Um, there will be, potentially, there will be scattered power uh, outages as well as downed trees. One of the things that we wanted to make sure um, was to tell our community, our residents, that we've been meeting about this, we've been talking about it, and that we are ready to serve you as a resident. Um, so what I did was uh, we just met, we talked with the fire chief, we talked with the police chief, um, as well as OEM, which is the Office of Emergency Management. And uh, we also had here who's going to come up and tell, tell us what we should do if we see a downed tree, if we should see power lines, what do we do? But I can tell you that we've been meeting um, and we've been um, talking about and talking through scenarios um, and what's important to us is your safety. So at this time, I'm gonna ask uh, Mr. George Phipps, who is our superintendent of our DPW to come and uh, just tell us um, and walk us through what should they do if um, there is a, a down line, what should they do if there is a, a tree that's down. And uh, as he's coming, I'm gonna step away because we are uh, practicing social, social distancing here. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is George Phipps, the superintendent for Public Works for the Borough of Roselle. The storm that we have coming our way, our main objective is, is the public safety. So if you do see a downed tree, what we ask you to do is to not go around it, try to back away from it. If anything, call to the nearest police department, 245-2000, report the uh, downed tree. Also, if you see any wires that may be down as well with the tree, do not get out of your car. Do not attempt to move the wire, touch the wire, anything. The wire can still be charged. Also, I want to add as well, if you happen to be coming down the street, you see any flooding, do not drive through the flooding. It could be deeper than what it really looks like. So once again, we're just asking you to back out of it, turn around, go in the opposite direction. Also, if at all possible, inform the police department. If any branches are down, what the police department will do, they will call over to the Department of Public Works. We'll get a supervisor out with the on-call staff and we'll have everything removed. If there's a power line, we will call the utility company to have them properly remove the charge lines. Once again, thank you. Will there be any, any type of um, um, disposal going on tomorrow or the day after or anything along those lines? Every, as far as the services right now, everything is still underway. Still be sanitation, recycling, uh, vegetative waste. Everything is still uh, status as quo. Still, awesome. still scheduled. Awesome. Now, keep in mind that this is going to start um, actually tomorrow. Actually, I'm hearing that we're probably going to get some rain starting tonight um, into tomorrow, tomorrow morning. So listen, just stay safe. If you don't have to uh, go anywhere, don't go anywhere. Try to stay in and keep yourself as well as your family safe. Um, that's what's important. Uh, once again, we'll be coming to you. We want you to make sure that you stay safe and uh, we want to make sure that we provide you with up-to-date information. As we move for forward into this, this year and as we move forward going into next year, we're going to do our very best to communicate as much as possible. We will have another uh, broadcast that will be focused totally on COVID. Um, just to make sure that you're up to date what's going on here in the borough of Roselle. Thank you for tuning in and I hope that this information is, um, is helpful to you. Thank you.